Oh my god! Oh wait, you're my robot, okay. <laughs> Jesus there, fucking Christ. Oh. Hello everybody, Joey Peach aka Majority here, and this is another episode of Wasteland Wednesday. Okay, and if you remember last time, actually, hold up. Can you hear me now? Okay, if you remember last time, we uh, just cleared out this place. So, uh, let's get started. Oh, wait, what were we even doing? I don't even remember. Well, anyways, sorry about last week if you're watching um, up to date of when I'm putting this up because I was testing a live streaming for future things. It didn't go well. And by the time I finished testing out stuff, it turned out it wasn't my fault. It was just uh, some friends of mine's internets are like ridiculously crappy. One of them is actually not getting what he's paying for sucks but uh oh well anyways uh i'm thinking about live streaming you should tell me what you think uh i can do it i got the internet for it but um if i wanted to do that i'd need donations for a second monitor so i could see what you guys are saying as i'm playing things because i'd want you to be part of my game but i don't have enough money for a second monitor or i do but it's in savings and i need to keep it there so sorry yeah anyways what we gotta do is uh uh, gain access to Vault 1, 2, on 1, 2, um, or... We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. We're gonna, we're gonna try to do this. Do not kill my lurks is an option. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. You know how to open doors. My bad. <laughs> well, you know... He got in my face. You know what, next time I'll just, you know, sorry, I'll, I'll let him kill me next time. This is why you need a shotgun when you take on these guys. Ooh, scrap. Hello. Okay. And I was like, science is bullshit. I don't believe in science. Um, oh, hey. Hey Bob. Oh. Bob from accounting. Uh. There you go. Not a Thank you. <sighs> oh, also, um, I have the option to put my webcam of my face up now, guys. Oh, I should probably put that at the beginning. Um, yeah, I'll probably put it in chat to ask if you want my face up while I play this. I bet you just, you just want to see my, my freaking beautiful face, because it's so beautiful. It's a face. Uh, no, oh, Jesus, what do you want, Bill? Go away. Nobody loves you. Oh, I found this. Hey, Bill, thanks. You told me where the spawning pods are, man. That's kind of what I meant to do. Uh, guys, we're going back to Megaton. We're taking the quick way once I get to up there. Wait, I have a house. Duh. I got so much things to put there. Oh my god! Oh wait, you're my robot, okay. <laughs> Jesus there, fucking Christ. Ugh. Ugh. I forgot you were my robot slave and not... Alright. Why can't I drop shiz? I wanted to drop stuff and it's not letting me like why do I not have a drop option hold on guys we'll be right back 
Okay, we're back, guys, and I figured out what the deal is. For some reason, I guess the controller doesn't seem to work with the dropping options. Uh, they might want to work on that, but, um... You know, I can grab stuff and whatnot. But anyways, um... I can't just drop it from my... I don't know, I have to send it. But my mouse will do it. You know, it doesn't have that option. And shut up, Wadsworth. Anyways, we're gonna go sell things now. Like cool people. Oh wait, no, we're gonna go sleep for bonus XP thing. Welcome home, sir. Hey, yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, there's nothing in here at all. So that's a thing. That's gonna be my secret room of mutilated organs and stuff. That's just my other my other hunting things. Mutilated organs, they're going in here. Cause I'm a bona fide mexter. I know that didn't sound like it made any sense, just deal with it. We gotta go to my repair. I'm telling you that we did a mission, but not the bonus, cause fuck the bonus tell us this for people who can be stealthy. I'm not good at it. I actually give people, I give props to people who can be stealthy because I have very little, it's not a little patience. I can do games with stealth, like Assassin's Creed, like Black Flag. I did stealth. I, it took forever. I did it. How's I can do it. How's the field research going? And you know, you get cold feet. So are they intelligent? Do they have- I said the observe, I don't think they'll forget <laughs> any type of- Oh no. You didn't rile them no, up, No, they riled me you? up. Because I'm not getting a very good signal. I think they buried it in the mud. Oh. Anyway, you saw them. At least a bit. What are your observations about them? Their layers are practically aquatic, so they radiate or partially aquatic, so radiation is not obvious. Between shells and the scales, they're pretty tough, but not tough enough. Interesting. I wonder if the toxicity of the water caused their mutations and forced them to adapt to the ground as well. I wish we could have gotten more information, but this will have to do for the book. Here's your pay. Maybe they'll help you be sneakier next time. Oh, shut up. Yeah, this will be second chapter's research, correct? Correct as always. Thank you. And your feedback's really led to a very smartly written book. See, guys? Maybe feedback. Too smart for some folks, feedback. I worry. Of course, if the reader can't be bothered to understand something important as a book on how to stay alive, then what can we do, huh? Yeah, what can and we do? in case those readers blame you for their ignorance, here's your payment. Two big boxes of ammo. Now, on to the next chapter. Big boxes of ammo? I love that. Like 15.32 caliber rounds, that's it. Okay, ready to start. Are you searching the last chapter? The last chapter is a bit more esoteric. It's about the survival of humanity as a whole and how to rebuild society. Deep stuff, huh? We oh need to know how large settlements are formed, how to harness the old technology, and I'll need you to get ancient history from a nearby library. Okay. We're in the last stretch now, so let's finish it up strong. What's first? Uh, using old technology something I could check the library. Someone's already here. No, look like you're actually out. How about researching local history? Sounds easy. Don't be so sure. You'd be surprised how confused people get, even about important things. In this case, I'm talking about Rivet City. It's the most successful survivor settlement around, but no one here really knows how it started. Of course, that's why it's important to know how a place like that succeeded. Yeah. So I need you to go there and do some researching. Great. Sounds reasonable. I'll research Rivet City's history. Oh, now I can't wait for what you find out down there. <laughs> and check around to make sure you're hearing the real deal. Yeah, no problem. I'm looking to buy some things from a... No. Think about your experience. Can I see something personal? Why, I'm flattered. What would you like to know? Why are you always working on such weird ideas? Well, look around at the world we live in. It may be okay to you, but I've read about what it used to be like, and this wasn't it. So we all need something that keeps us going, despite all the terrible things around us. <laughs> For me, it's things like this book. I don't understand. Crazy experience or will keep you going or 
But why do you waste your talents on this garbage? It's not garbage. Yeah, just go on. Oh, stay at Grace. Grace, no, no it, one's gonna... it's like uh, either of them are nice. Did you ever try to put a broken piece of glass back together? Even if the pieces fit, you can't make it whole again the way it was. But if you're clever, you can still use the pieces to make other useful things. Maybe even something wonderful, like a mosaic. Well, the world broke just like the glass. And everyone's trying to put it back together like it was. But it'll never come together the same way. That was actually really deep. Guys, you need to quote Myers Brown's last statement. That was deep. She is smart. So you're trying to make the world better than it was? Hey, it sounds crazy when you say it that way. But that's what I'm aiming for. Yeah. The Wasteland Survival Guide isn't much toward that lofty goal, but it's an important one. Yep. And that's why I need your help. I don't think I can do it alone. Oh, so sad. I'll help ya. Let's talk about River City's history. Any luck finding- River City is actually the remains of an ancient- What? <laughs> Try asking around a bit. You never know who's collected a lot of information. Okay. What the fuck is this? Who the fuck? Who? I wish there were more oh. people like you in the world. Hi. I want you to have this. I hope it helps keep you safe. Oh. Certainly. Thank you. I'll see. Not so close. That's a really cool gun. I mean, look at it. That's pretty awesome. Guys, we're going to enjoy this gun. Uh, interested in buying the scrap metal? I sure am, Sonny. I have. Just take all the scrap metal I have. No charges. Huh. Well, all right. Let me count out your caps. Yay. I didn't level up, though. You have fun keeping the water... Pro I feel like a good person now, because the water processing plant got something it needed. Yay! Now let's go to Rivet City. Rivets, I think, were what they used to make. I think rivets were bullets and planes, but I don't know. I could be wrong. Hmm. I probably play this game a lot longer than what you guys see. Like, I do pretty much everything you see, but, like, there's a long inter increments of me walking and stuff. Why is there ammunition here? I'll take a missile. I'll take that. I'll take that. I just realized that was there. Hey, yeah, I'll take that, too. Why, why not? Purified water and a stem tech? Fuck yeah. Is that always here, or just, like, it, just something that was in a mod that I never noticed yet, or... How do I get back up? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to swim back up, aren't I? Dally ho! Okay. Oh, here's a good spot. That's good. I'm enjoying this. I'm having a good day. Guys, I've been pretty down lately. I don't know why I've been down. Uh, I've just been kind of down lately. I have no real particular reason. It's not really like like depressed, just like ugh, nothing seems to be super exciting or stimulating. But hey, that's just how it is sometimes. You're gonna have to wait out till you get excited about things again. This game's pretty nice. I don't know. It seems to make me really happy when I like record things. And I'm I'm not one of those bullshitters. I don't think there's too many of those, but I'm I'm sure there's some. I really do, it's just, it feels productive and fun at the same time to do stuff like recording stuff for you guys. Not to mention, I try to make it fun, especially when I have it with friends, because it's like enjoying a thing together. <laughs> you know, you can probably tell people, this is like the closest thing I get to like, weekly vlogging, is this game right here, because I got plenty of time to talk to you peeps. And uh, yeah, nah, it's, it, I feel really happy when I get to record stuff fun thing for you guys to know in a couple days I gotta like wipe my computer I mean I'm gonna send stuff all my footage and stuff to my two terabyte hard drive but I gotta wipe it because I don't even know something happened with my operating system it's Windows 8 so it's go figure 
I really don't know what happened. It happened when I signed out and back in, all of a sudden things in the control panel didn't work right. Uh, it seems like missing DLLs, registry keys or something. I don't know, I'm gonna fix it though by completely rebooting Windows 8 again, making hey. it the system. And then sending all the other files I have for my games and stuff over there. But it might be a while, so if you see this video and there's still not that much stuff coming out, it's because I have to. Let me or a fix security all. officer know if you see anything out of the ordinary. Is there a problem? Why are you the only soldier in the name? Bannon and Dr. Oh, Lee and I all meet on Monday mornings to talk about. It's pretty informal. The council doesn't have much real power. Like the city councils and stuff. So the trusty old duck. We're the safest, most secure well, yeah, city in the wasteland. Nothing can get in here without our say so. She's one of the members of the council. Runs the science lab here. Don't bother her unless it's important. All right. Her lab is in the stern end of the ship. Yes, sir. By the way, you guys didn't know. I like Fallout 3 a lot more than New Vegas. I think a lot of people did. Just the feel of it in general. It feels... feels like there's a lot more to explore in a sense. Not to mention the add-ons are freaking amazing. <laughs> Do you know about River City's history? I don't exactly have time to worry about the history around here, now do I? I've got to worry about what's happening on it now. You sound like a dick. But thanks for your help. Anything about the history of River City? Fred, I can't help you, pal. Been here for years, but all I know about the history is that it's a safe place to settle down. Wait, I know who to Maybe go to. Maybe Bannon can help you out. He sure acts like he knows it all. Okay, are you Bannon? Hey. You're shrapnel. Who the hell's shit? Yeah, hey, leveled up from stealing. Let's share the leader. Swift went west. Let's let's look at this. Okay, and we're back. And uh, Saint Monica bless you. Yeah, thank you. And uh, let's see. Oh, we gotta find that one dude. Uh, hold on one second, guys. Okay, we're back. Uh, I was really hoping there was a jury rig. Where I could have sworn this game had something like it. Guess I was wrong. Actually, Vera Weatherly might know more. She's always here and talking with folks, so if anyone's picked up a story or two... Hey, I'm hungry. Here was our menu, sir. I want to just steal all the food. I mean, not steal, buy it, but... Okay. Mm -hmm. Just impact, why not? Thank you, Another sir. satisfied... Have a good day. Hotel is in here. Yeah, the weather big but tough. That's the wrong room, what am I doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome back, sir. Hey, you. Poor James. His mother drinks too much. When she does, she doesn't treat him very well. Oh. Personally, I think she blames him for his father leaving her, which is ridiculous. Nice. Do you know anything about River City's history? Well, I could tell you all about my hotel. But I'm sure I don't know anything about how Rivet City itself got started. I mean, you hear rumors and you make guesses, but I really couldn't say I know for sure. And I'd hate to lead you down the wrong path. Is there anyone who knows more? Actually, now that you mention it, Seagrave may know more about it. He's been here since he was just a boy, and I can't imagine anyone knows this ship better than he does. Thank you. You don't look so tough. They call me sister. Don't ask. But you're a man, why they Are you making <laughs> fun of my name? It's a damn good thing for you this place is crawling with security. Otherwise, I'd kick your ass. Okay, sister. 
cut an asshole. Welcome back, sir. Wait, so, uh, do you have any more of this? Uh. Actually, now that you mention it. Okay, now what do you know? Well, if it'll help. I once heard that this place was covered in Myrlurks 50 years ago, waiting all around the city. Eventually, some poor soul they thought would be lunch fought back and cleared out the whole ship. He set up the city in their place. Oh, cool. They say he was the first counselor for the upper deck and lived here to his death. Can't say I believe it a bit. Okay. See you. Yeah, yeah, good to see you too, man. Oh, it's gonna take forever. Any luck finding out how we're well, if it's I suppose that sort of thing happens occasionally. Oh well. Still, for your help, have a few of these. They may help out next time you need to. I've got to do a section on working with old computer electronics. Mm -hmm. So there's some research to be done in the old Robco production facility. Oh, really? Also, there used to be a big library out there. <laughs> Imagine a whole building full of books. Jesus, I'll horrible. need you to gather information there for me. No! And that'll be it for the last chapter. So, what'll it be? Using all technology sounds interesting. It does, doesn't it? I mostly just deal with it after it's junked. But a trader gave me this Robco processor widget. Ooh. He said it's worth a fortune. I bet it is. According to him, if it's connected to the mainframe in the Robco factory, you could have access to all the robots you'd ever want. Now that would Sounds be a good great be example of how to harness technology, wouldn't it? But yeah, it'd be pretty cool. Just go in and connect the widget to the mainframe? I can do that. Yeah, you should just be able to plug it into the mainframe at the Robco production facility. It'll give you access to the robots and terminals. Okay, here. And be sure to keep an eye peeled for any other examples of how to make old technology work for you out there. Let's talk about those robots. Fiddle with any interesting technology lately? I haven't been to Virtue's Roco facility yet. Well, why not go over there and make a few friends? Or activate them, I guess. I guess that sounds like see a ya. good idea. See ya later. Hi. Why do I have over a thousand five millimeter bullets? Let's see from that one thing. But hey, 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 guys, guys, if you're just listening to me, watch me, look at me. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.